The Memorial Day holiday weekend is here and that typically means a rise in boating, but a tragedy in the last week is top of mind for many. It has been nearly a week now since an Erlanger woman fell into the Ohio River. And this is video of the search seen from days ago. Nine on your sides. Marielle Carbone is live at Schmidt Field boat ramp. And Marielle, how is that accident affecting other boaters? Well, the boater I spoke to today tells me that that accident is a tragedy and it really affects anyone thinking about going out on the water. That's why he tells me from the moment he leaves this boat ramp to the moment he gets back here, safety is top of mind. It's the first trip on the water this season for Joe Dosher. Check the boat out, make sure that everything's running the way it should and, uh, you know, get it ready for the weekend. For him, it's all about fun, but it's also a serious matter. It's not like a car. If you have an issue, you can pull over the side of the road. If you have an issue on the boat, you're at the mercy of the current. News of missing boater Whitney Crank. It really grounds you. So he'll be careful, like always. Mirroring advice from the Coast Guard Auxiliary. You know, make sure that you are going out on the water with somebody who is experienced on the water, has driven a boat before, knows knows the rules while on the water. Lieutenant Jim Brendel says the majority of issues they see involve alcohol. And according to the Coast Guard, in most accidents that result in a drowning, the boater is not wearing a life jacket. So take caution. Just be aware of your surroundings and know what you're doing out there. Uh, go slow, take your time, enjoy the weather. Keeping passengers and other boaters safe this holiday weekend. Everybody have a good time. Be safe. Uh, you know, be uh, considerate of boaters, you know, that are anchored out. Don't go zooming by them. At And the auxiliary will be doing courtesy vessel inspections. That's tomorrow starting at 10 a.m. at the Manhattan Harbor. Reporting live from Schmidt Boat Landing, Marielle Carbone, 9 on your side. Marielle, thanks so much. So we have reached out to the Boone County Water Rescue. We want an update on their search for crank, but we have yet to hear back.